New inside of Rebel 6 is the new Liquify tool. Now this is a massive improvement over any of the Liquify tools I've seen anywhere. Uh, this is a very, very uh, intelligent Liquify tool. You can use it directly on the canvas. You don't have to go into a special window and it retains the details of the structure that's underneath. Now this is a picture by Nicola Dunford. She's one of the featured artists with Rebel, and I love her work. Beautiful use of light and shadow, skin tones, and the texture of the piece is really, really nice. And what we're gonna do is we're going to look at using the Liquify tool here. Now I'm gonna show you first what it looks like when we just simply use Smudge. So we're going to Smudge here, and you can see we're immediately, while we're getting the shape changes that we want, we're losing all of that detail. It's blurring while it's smudging. Now Rebel 6 Pro uses the new Fractal Engine, which is a machine learning and AI based algorithm and process that keeps all of the detail in there. So let's go ahead and look at that. We're gonna choose Liquify Push, and we're going to use, I have my Liquify tool moved into my favorites, uh, and we're going to use this one. So you can see I can push, but we're not losing that detail. It's not blurring the image in order to push. So we can construct a very different type of nose without having to repaint. Now there is a reconstruct. So we can bring this back to its original shape. Let's say we want to give him a little bit different expression here. We can move the mouth into a small smile, bring it down. And this is a very, again, a very usable tool that doesn't destroy the underlying artwork or structure. Okay, let's go ahead and restore this back. You can see these little tiny subtle differences really make a difference in expressions. Okay, so the Liquify Push tool if we go over here to the tool itself and look at the different options, I'm using the soft brush. If you use spiky, it does something very different than if we use a soft brush. So let's go ahead and undo that. So keep in mind these create very different effects depending on what brush you're using. Now when you're using this brush, opacity you can kind of think of uh, like a strength slider. So we're gonna adjust this and you can see it's very small, subtle adjustments. If we increase the opacity, then those little adjustments are going to pull a bit further, push a bit further, expand a little bit more. So let's go ahead and use Liquify Expand and we're gonna do a little bit of expansion here and not a lot. And then let's go ahead and reconstruct that, bring the opacity back up so that it reconstructs a little bit quicker. Now, Liquify is a tool inside of Rebel 6. It's not a separate window. You don't have to leave your canvas in order to make these adjustments, which is really cool. You can also save your smudge and liquify brushes as a brush preset. So you can go over to your favorites and you can see that you have an option for liquify right here inside of the favorites brushes. Along with push, there is expand. There's pinch. Again, let's do pinch, but let's turn the opacity down. Just do a little bit of a pinch. Very useful. Push left, when you go up, it's going to push left. When you go down, it's going to push right. There's twirl. And reconstruct. I love having Reconstruct available. It is very, very useful to me. If you have questions about the new Liquify tool, put it in the comment section. 
the Fractal Engine is just available in Rebel 6 Pro. Rebel 6, the non-pro version, uses the bilinear processing, and I'll have a demonstration of the differences between those two in a separate video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll look forward to reading your comments. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video.